Ladies and gentlemen, we got the we got the cans on because today's the day that Cody confronts his biggest lie. Oh, to none other than what's up, what's up Jared, dude? Jared Goff. <laughs> Welcome to the show, man. How are y'all doing? We're good, man. How are you? Good. Good. Well, this is awesome. Yeah, yeah, dude. Thanks for coming on, man. Uh, just know that for the rest of this interview, we will both be telling the truth. Okay. We'll make sure That's that right. Cody. That's we'll right. Sure that Cody I can't wait. Truth. I'm gonna be telling the truth too. I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait. Well, first of all, yeah. before Jared gets into it, Cody, go ahead. Okay. What? Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry for lying to you. I just got nervous. Yeah, I, I guess I'm sorry for lying too. I, I guess my, <laughs> yeah, my, actually, my, you lied too, dog. I did. I did. So my my up? my brain was playing some tricks on me, and um, <laughs> I was sitting here at home. My buddy's like, "Hey, did you see that uh, podcast?" Thing they're talking about you. I'm like, what are you talking about? So he showed me it, and I was dying because I was, I like I told you quickly, I was actually thinking about it afterwards. Like, was he actually there? Like, <laughs> yeah. Well, he, well, he said he was, so he had to be. You mementoed each other. Yeah, That's we really impressive. did. Here's the question though, because a lot of people are debating in the comments, like, who is he thinking about? Was my theory was it Jimmy Tatro? No. So I'll, I'll, t- I'll tell you exactly what happened. Okay. Okay. So I, me and Jimmy are good friends, and and I know Jimmy well. And then I obviously know who you are from Real Bros of Simi Valley. Ah, uh, okay. And my girlfriend and I watch some of your stuff, and like we know who you are, and like you know we're we're fans of you and your girlfriend, and fiance, I guess. And now I've been keeping up with it, so congratulations. Oh, thanks, dude. But yeah, so I saw you walk in, and I was like, oh, there's okay, I know who that is. And then when you were walking by, I was like, I'll say hi to him. And and like as I was going to say hello, I was like, oh, I've already met him. He was at that at the California Strong game. He was there with Jimmy, and it all kind of like just got confused in my brain. So I was like, oh, I've I've already met him. So I was like, oh, hey, hey, Cody, I'm Jared. Like, I think we've already met. It was like all within like a split second that I was like, oh, I've already met him. And then when you were like, oh yeah, I was there. I was like, okay, well, he was there. Okay, good. Like it all kind of it all kind of worked that way. And then after you had left, I was like, wait, was he actually there? Like, and I was looking at like I was thinking about it. I was like, you know, and obviously Jimmy and you are connected, so there was a little bit of confusion there. But I, I guess I, my brain just told me that you were there, and 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 clearly you weren't. Did either of you even go to Mexico? Like, did you guys dream up that whole situation <laughs> this, as well? Did any of this actually happen? Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's yeah. a real question. Yeah. Did you ever think at any point, like afterwards, like, man, he wasn't there. What a piece of shit. No, no, not until, <laughs> okay, I, saw okay. the, not until I saw the podcast with you guys. You didn't think about it until you watched the podcast and then you realize, oh, that was a shitty thing he did. He was actually, it was actually, he was saving me. He was saving me the embarrassment is what he was doing. <laughs> exactly. So it was actually a really admirable thing to do. Right. Because so. if you had been like, if you would have been like, no, I would have been like, oh, well, never mind. Have a good day. <laughs> <laughs> <You know? laughs> So yeah, it, no, it was, uh, and, and my buddy was like, my buddy was there too. So he was like, was he there? And I was like, I think so. <laughs> he said he was there. So was your buddy there uh, at the game? Yeah. Yeah. He was, he wasn't okay. playing in it, but he was there, I believe. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. That's, that's hilarious. That's really funny. <laughs> Through you just looking at each other like, right? We all, we're right. all boys, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. right. 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 We all shared a hot dog. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> One time. I, I probably owe Cody a thank you for, for not embarrassing me in front of some of my friends there. Uh, Jared, no, thank you, Jared your media training is coming through like a shining yeah, star. Yeah, seriously. It, you I, I've, done, I've done a few of these. You know? <laughs> yeah. I've, I've, yeah. Had, I've had my uh, fair share. I got it. This, this is this is the most professional podcast with Tiny Meat Gang as the name. <laughs> oh, thank you, man. <laughs> It's uh, it's really done well. You guys do a good job. Oh, thank you, thanks, man. bro. Appreciate yeah, when it. you have small meat, you have to focus on other things. You know, production, right. you gotta personality. Make up for it, right? Yeah, yeah. I I gotta thank you for making me look cool in front of my friends. Because sure. as I said in the Any, anytime, episode, yeah. they were all freaking out. And then the one guy that was with me afterwards, he was like, "How the, how do you know him?" And I was like, "I don't." <laughs> yeah. And likewise, I didn't know you at the time either. <laughs> that well, was good. listen, I felt. I felt so bad about lying about a charity softball game that I went on your website, which, by the way, what the fuck is that URL, dude? JTG.store or something like that? Is that uh, even? JTG16.store. Dot store? Yeah. That, is that a scam? <laughs> no. Who the fuck no, is a dot no, store? I, I, You're <laughs> I saw your donation. Thank you very much. Yeah, I donated really to the Detroit you. Lion Foundation because I... <laughs> Felt bad for lying about going to a charity game. Nice. You're going to lie about the number you donated now? <laughs> I donated. It was a million, right? Yeah, yeah right? It, was, it was a million. Oh, yeah, no, thank you very much. Changing lives all over the place. Changing lives. Yeah. No, if, if there ever is another charity softball game where I vibe something, you're going to be the first one invited. We should throw one. That's what we should do. Like, yeah. We should make one happen. Yeah, let's do one. TMG, Jared Goff, do the, yeah, the actual charity softball game. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You can get tickets on 
TMG day, JTG dot store. And then yeah. um and then neither of you will show up. <laughs> <laughs> but then we'll talk about it post. Yeah. Like yeah. Exactly. Yeah. God, we raised so much money that day. Yeah. I'm glad we were able to hash this out, man. Thanks for coming on the yeah. show. We appreciate hey, man, it. Man, thank you. That was that was funny to watch. I was in tears watching it because I was like, oh my God, that all makes sense now. <laughs> and 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 it is like the funny thing of like, you know. We have mutual friends, but like we clearly didn't know each other. I was acting as if I did know you and, and you were acting as if you don't know we didn't know each other. And just trying to play it too cool, you know? It's just too much LA going on. Yeah, that's what it is. If if anything, you, you know what that makes me think of weirdly? So I was at a restaurant and Margot Robbie uh walks in to get pickup. And um That's sick. The whole yeah. well no, just hold on. So hot. The whole room is like bugging out that she's in there. And this dude, he like, he's like with his buddies and he kind of like makes a gesture to his friends in the vein of like, watch this. Turns around, he's like, hey. She's like, hi. He's like, John, remember we, uh, and he just starts like saying stuff. He's like trying to socially engineer her. And he had her for a second. She was like, eh, yeah. No, no, I don't, I don't think, I think. So I, she didn't, she didn't pull at me. She just. No. She said no. Well, no, it took her a second. Okay. So what I'm saying is this is all just saying like in LA, if you just do like, right. yeah, no, we met at the softball game. If you do that right. enough, <laughs> you can probably end up at like Elon Musk's house. I mean, we would know. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> that actually happened to us. Yeah. <laughs> I may actually use that on someone else if I, if I really don't know them. Yeah. Uh, hey, like, hey, you know, good to see you. You remember the softball game? And oh, yeah. Yeah. Or if they say no, I'm like, no, you were definitely there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You got to bully them into it. <laughs> no, yeah. you were there, dude. You made yeah. that big donation. Dude, good on you, man. Right, You're the right, fucking right. man. You're a nice guy, dude. Yeah. Straight up, man. Hell yeah. Well, Cody, thank you for being so nice. For not embarrassing me and then the donation you the man thank appreciate you man it. really appreciate you coming on and good to actually meet you for, and, as uh, as as who we think each other are exactly so <laughs> now uh, fans of, fan of the show and fan of you guys so keep it up you guys are doing great thanks oh, and cody oh this is the other thing you and i are actually business partners in, in friday beers oh no way really yes oh hell yeah you, did you invest i did oh fuck yeah I love so, those guys. Do you know them? You and I are like you and I are like two of like four celebrity investors, whatever you want. To call I wouldn't that. call Cody a celebrity, but <laughs> I would definitely call and, you a celebrity. And, and their podcast, their podcast is coming out soon, and me and you are the first two episodes. Let's go. Well, okay, Jared, friend and now business partner. There thanks for coming on the podcast. Appreciate it. Appreciate and, you, uh, man. Yeah, see you soon. Thanks, guys, for having me. Have fun. Yeah, of course. See yeah. you later, dude. All right. Sweet. All right, that was fun. That was great. Um, are you okay with keeping all that investing in Friday beers things in, or do you want us to cut early on? Yeah, I never invested in Friday beers. <laughs> are you serious? I was about to, and then I didn't. <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> We're not rolling. Why? Oh, audio? Audio? Yeah, dude, we got that. We got that. We got that. We got that. What the fuck is wrong with me? What is wrong with me? Why do I keep doing this? <laughs> Bro, I need to fucking... That has to stay in. What is wrong with me? That is staying in. I'm dead. I'm fucking dead. He did it again. He did it again. <laughs> Ryan fell to his fucking knees. Oh my god. <laughs> I I've been in LA too long. I think that's what it is, man. I like something's wrong, dude. <laughs> You even said new friend and business partner. Now you like hammered it. Home. I hammered it home. What the fuck is wrong you with me? Fucking doubled down. I, I was thinking in my head. I was like, trip. now I have to invest in order to make this trip. <laughs> <laughs> I, I I don't blame you. You looked right at the camera. And went to my friend and <laughs> business partner, <laughs> and you took the most confident drink and you logged <laughs> off. And Ryan's like, are you cool with that? And you're like, I never invested. <laughs> I gotta get away for a while. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is oh wrong with me? Oh my god. I'm bro. sorry, dude. <laughs> I mean, I just, there's no.
That couldn't be more perfect. You couldn't script that better. Oh my god. I was trying to make the show flow, so I had to say that. If I would have said no, it would have been like, no, you're we're not business partners, and it would have been it would have been the exact same as if I said no in Cabo. Right? Uh, yes, sir. I have no words. I can only laugh. <laughs>